hello and welcome to the online class and this is the class 9 compulsory math uh, so students uh, we will start get mathematics from lesson from unit 6 that is algebraic expression and in algebraic expression the first exercise is about uh, the factorization factorization uh, so let's start this so first of all you have to understand you have to know the basic knowledge uh, on how to factorize the algebraic expression uh, so so i'm going to tell you about this here you already as you already have read in class 8 also how to factorize the algebraic expressions so here uh, first thing first thing in first step of factorizing the algebraic expression is to take common for the binomial and trinomial and polynomial terms in the monomial term uh, we simply have to factorize its factors uh, by multiplying uh, so uh, in case of binomial and upper binomial trinomial uh, expressions the first step is to take common we have to take common and after taking common and uh, the expression how like the expression will be there according to that we will factorize for example uh, we can take common if there is a x plus b x is one expression uh, is one binomial expression we can take x common from these two terms x x is the common x is common and the remaining term a plus b okay and after taking common if uh, this expression is in the form of a square plus a square minus b square if the form will come in terms of a square minus b square we can further factorize it by applying the formula for a plus b a minus b and if it will come in in the form of uh, a cube plus b cube if after taking common if it will come in the form of a cube plus b cube then we can simply factorize by applying the formula a plus b uh, a square minus a b plus b square okay this, these are the two factors of a cube plus b cube and after taking common this expression come in the form of a cube minus b cube in that case uh, the, these two factors will be a minus b and a square plus a b plus b square okay so the first thing is to do if is there any common from the terms we will take common and write on the remaining and the remaining if this is in the form of simply a plus b we will leave it here only if this uh, after taking common if this term will come in the form of a square minus b square then we will factorize it as a plus b a minus b and if it will come in the form of a q plus b q then we have to factorize this as uh, a q plus b q is the formula there is one formula a plus b into a square minus a q plus b square and if it will come in the form of a q minus b q then it will be a minus b a square plus a b plus b square so let's start the exercise 6.1 factorization we will do uh, solve uh, some form, uh, some questions from the exercise so everyone take out your book and turn on the page number 102 exercise 6.1 exercise 6.1 page number 102 page number 102 uh, very short questions number a number a uh, one okay number a one factorize number one, uh, a one of a is 2x plus 4y so how to factorize this this is very simple we can simply take the common from 2 and 4 obviously 2 is common 2 is common and the remaining term here x and here uh, 2 to the 4 2 y well, this is the answer and b number look at the what is there in b number b number similarly 3 ax minus 
3 a y 3 a x minus 3 a y and here 3 a 3 a are the common 3 a common x minus y so this is also here only ok now look at and sometimes we uh, make a group uh, if there is the four terms uh, example now look at the example now c number you can do yourself c number you can do yourself uh, now number two number two a if this will be in the form of a x minus y plus b x minus y so here what you, you can do here this is uh, if you look this x minus y x minus y as a single term then this is binomial with common x minus y x minus y so x minus y is the common and the remaining is a plus b of oh, this is the answer for this number and now look at this b number b number is here 3 a x 3 a x minus b x minus 3 a y plus b y plus b y so one we can do here look at that from all four terms there is no common so we can take common from these two and these two separately okay this equals to we can take common here x x is the common x is common and the remaining term 3a 3a minus b and we are in this two term minus b uh, y is common minus y common and the remaining 3a if if you take minus common here it will be plus 3a is plus and if you plus it will be minus minus b and next step also it will be here and now from these two 3a minus b 3a minus b is again common so we can take 3a minus b is common and x minus y okay this is the answer to this question now uh, I am leaving C number for your practice. Now look at the D number. D number, how we can capitalize? D number D is there 25 x square, 25 x square minus 1 by 36 y square. And this equals to 25 can be written in, in the form of 5 square. Okay. So 5 square and 5 x square is 5 x whole. 25 x square is 5 x of whole square minus and this is 36 is also a square number a square for 6 uh, so 1 by 6 y whole square we can write here and now since this is in the form of a square minus b square we can apply the formula for a plus b a minus b so simply we for a plus b is 5x plus 1 by 6 y and 5x minus 1 by 6y. Because these are the two factors for this expression. So very simple. Now let's do question number B. Uh, some numbers from question number B. short questions there are also short questions b short questions number 3 number 3a 3a is 64b square minus 9c square 64 is the square of 8 8 is the 64 so 8b whole square we can write and minus 9 is 3 square 3c whole square we can write and this is in the form of a square minus b square and the factors are a plus b a minus b that is a b plus 3c a b minus 3c okay now another another you can do uh, c number now let's look at this uh, c number i will do selectively uh, 
C number. Now we'll see. 3x cube, 3x cube minus 6x square y minus 6x square y plus 3xy square plus 3xy square. Okay, what is is there anything common from all three terms? Hmm. Look at that. 3, 6, 3. 3 is common, obviously. 3 is common. And x cube, x square, x, x is common. So, 3x only is the common here. After taking 3x common, what has been left here? 3 is already common, x square left, x square minus 3, 2 is 6, 2, x, y plus 3x is common, y square. Okay. Now, this is in the form of a square minus 2ab plus b square. So, that is for x minus y whole square. And for whole square, the factors are 3x, x minus y, x minus y. So, these are the factors for this expression. So, now from this uh, 3 number, last one, j number I will for you, j number. 3j, j number we have j 3j uh, there is a 2a8 2a8 minus 18 a square b square a square Square. And this equals to 2 is common and from a8 and a square, a square is common. 2a square is common. And what is left here now? 2 is already common, a square common and so from here a to the power 6 left. Minus uh, 2 9 is 18. So 9 left and a is for already common b is for left here. and this equals to 2 a square and a power 6 can be written as a cube whole square a cube we can write here a cube whole square minus and for this one 3 b whole square give a square bracket and this equals to 2 a square now a cube plus 3b by the formula a plus b a minus b from a square minus b square come so a plus b a minus b is a cube minus 3b so this is the answer to this question now let's look at uh, one question from question number four question number four Question number four now. Four number. Uh, so four number. Uh, look at here. Four uh, a only. Look at here. Four a. Three a plus two b whole square. Three a plus two b whole square. Minus. Minus three a minus two b. Three a minus two b. Whole square. Of this as a whole in the form of a square minus b square. If this you suppose as a, this is a square, and this if you suppose as b, uh, this is b square. So a square minus b square form. So we can simply factorize this as a plus b, a minus b. a plus b is simply 3a plus 2b a plus 3a minus 2b a plus b and a minus b 3a plus 2b minus minus 3a minus 2b okay now open the small bracket 3a plus 2b plus 
थ्री ए माइनस टू बी एंड थ्री ए प्लस टू बी माइनस थ्री ए एंड माइनस माइनस प्लस टू बी सो वाट इट विल बी माइनस टू बी प्लस टू बी कैंसल थ्री ए प्लस थ्री ए सिक्स ए इंटू माइनस थ्री ए प्लस थ्री ए कैंसल टू बी प्लस टू बी फोर बी सिक्स फोर द ट्वेंटी फोर ए बी इन द आंसर ओके लोग अगर बी नंबर उस लोग का बी नंबर फोर बी फोर बी फाइव एक्स प्लस वाई फाइव एक्स प्लस वाई फाइव एक्स प्लस वाई प्लस ट्वेंटी फाइव एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस ट्वेंटी फाइव एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस ट्वेंटी फाइव एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस वाई स्क्वायर एंड दिस इक्वल्स टू फाइव एक्स प्लस वाई इज सिंगल टर्म एंड दिस ट्वेंटी फाइव एक्स स्क्वायर कैन बी रिटर्न एज फाइव एक्स होल स्क्वायर माइनस वाई स्क्वायर एंड दिस इज द फॉर्म ऑफ ए स्क्वायर माइनस बी स्क्वायर सो दिस कैन बी रिटर्न एज ए प्लस बी ए माइनस बी फाइव एक्स प्लस वाई इज यू कैन बी ब्रैकेट आल्सो प्लस फाइव एक्स प्लस वाई एंड फाइव एक्स माइनस वाई ओके नाउ टेक कॉमन फाइव एक्स प्लस वाई फाइव एक्स प्लस वाई इज द कॉमन फाइव एक्स प्लस वाई एंड आफ्टर टेकिंग कॉमन दिस फाइव एक्स यू हैव इट टू डिमेंड वन ओके प्लस फाइव एक्स माइनस वाई सो दिस इज द आंसर ओके नाउ लेट्स लुक एट वन लास्ट क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम लॉन्ग क्वेश्चन Uh, oh, five number left. Five number. Five number. Five. Uh, five number also similar. You can do it. Or uh, look at the five number. Five first number. Five a. Five a. M n square. M n square. M minus p. Minus p plus m. Okay. So minus p plus m. Okay. Now look at it. This. What you can do here? First of all, open the bracket. Or ah. Uh, okay. Ah uh, p minus. P plus n. Uh, okay, look at that. You can uh, make it P minus m. Take minus common here. M n square and make it here P minus m. If you take minus common, it will be P minus m. And take minus common here, and it will be P minus m. Okay, now P minus m. P minus m is common. P minus m and the remaining minus m n square minus. If it is all is common here, one left. So this is the answer. So other you try yourself. Now let's see one question from last long question. Question number six. Question number six. ओके लॉन्ग क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स ए सिक्सटी फोर ए सिक्स सिक्सटी फोर ए सिक्स बी माइनस ए सिक्स बी माइनस बी सेवन टेक कॉमन बी इज कॉमन सिक्सटी फोर ए सिक्स माइनस बी सिक्स Now make square eight square eight a q whole square minus b q whole square. 
Now this is in the form of a square minus b square. So b a plus b is a a q plus b q and a a q minus b q. Okay, now we'll apply the cubic formula here. To factorize this, apply the cube formula. Uh, we have a q a q plus b q equals to a plus b a square minus a b plus b square and a q minus b q equals to a minus b a square minus plus a b plus b square in this formula you can apply for this two both so here 2 8 a cube can be written as 2 a whole cube plus b cube and here also 2 a whole cube minus b cube okay by that formula now b or uh, 2 a plus b and uh, a square is 2 a whole square is 4 a square 4 a square minus a b is 2 a b plus b square and for this one is 2 a minus b and it will be 4 a square plus 2 a b plus b square okay this much is the answer for this uh, 6 number 6 a for this much so for uh, today this much only and you can do the remaining numbers from this exercise 6.1 yourself you try to solve the problems from exercise 6.1 next time we will start the other exercise thank you for watching okay thank you goodbye